Okay, Tony. We need to show the world what AIM's been up to. And I've got the perfect opportunity. The AIM experience in Manhattan. The media launch for Tarleton's new adaptoids. Every network will be there. I think it would be a perfect place for a few dozen missing Inhumans to suddenly reappear. We have to be careful, though. AIM will bury the truth and kill any remaining prisoners rather than risk exposure. We'll need the location of their lab so we can lock it down. Good thing you captured Tarleton's second in command. If someone can get her to slip, it'll be Bruce. He's already volunteered. Not bad, Tony. Head on down to the interrogation room. I'll let Bruce know he's on deck. Miss Romanoff, Dr. Pym would like a word with you at the war table at your earliest convenience. Greetings from the anthill. Natasha? Thanks for helping save the day back at Ames Prison, and for everything you did as Tiny Dancer. I wondered who our mysterious guardian angel was. Anytime, Hank. Sometimes dirty hands do the best work. True. And how the hell did you folks get the Chimera online, let alone airborne, without Terrigen? The Chimera has the same standard engines as older helicarriers. She's kind of like a hybrid car. But, you know, cool. Something tells me this isn't just a thank you call, Doctor. Guilty as charged. We did a little digging in the data you sent me from the prison. AIM was able to successfully transport most of the Inhumans. I've tracked the ship, but we'll need someone to go in after it. We'll do whatever we can. Thanks. I've already uploaded some mission details to your war table. Pam out. if anything changes. Enjoying the view? Not enough to distract me from what's waiting downstairs. But I think I'm ready. I guess I have to be. Okay, I'm gonna go prep the interrogation room for you. If you want to chat, I'm just a radio call away. Thanks, Nat. I just need to, you know, ponder some things for a bit. Yeah, well, don't ponder too much. Oh, hey, Nat. Since Roy brought up all the power cores needed for the Chimera, the I figured he could stay up there and help outfit you all as needed. We can repurpose another aimbot to take his place nice here work. at the anthill. Roger, stand down and await further instructions. Nat, um... I'm about to talk to Monica. She's gonna try to manipulate you. You know that, right? I think I know Monica well. No, you don't. There are a thousand Monicas. She switches them like masks when she needs to. Yeah. Look, all I'm saying is if you go in there with expectations, she's gonna blindside you. Are all exits secure? Yes, Agent Romanoff. Good. Open the airlock for me, and don't open it for anyone else but Dr. Banner. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Initiating airlock override protocol. You've worked with Monica for a long time. She's changed, hasn't she? No, you see, I don't honestly believe she ever had any true feelings for you. But if I'm wrong, if she betrays any real emotions, Exploit them. That's your leverage. <laughs> Always appreciated your brutal honesty, Nat. You can do this, Bruce. More importantly, you have to. We need to find the rest of those inhuman prisoners before we crash the party at the AIM experience. Is the prisoner secure? That room was built to contain a Hulk. She's not going anywhere. Good. Speaking of, do not let anyone pass except for Dr. Banner. Copy that. Okay, we ready to do this?
Oh, this should be interesting. These two haven't spoken since the hearings. Think Bruce is up to it? He better be. Once we break up Tarleton's little party, he'll clean house. The AIM experience. So many better names. Look, we need the location of that lab. Hundreds of inhumans depend on it. So tiny dancer, huh? Let me guess, you would have gone with Rocket Man. Please, not even close. You're my candle in the wind. The show's about to start. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. The triumphant return of the Avengers. Imprisonment and torture. That's how AIM's gonna make the world a better place. Please. Ebola, smallpox, polio, all fatal, if not for the lab rats. And humans aren't sick, Monica. You're just harvesting their powers to make your little robots. <laughs> robots that possess complex AI. Capable of assessing the most effective application of their powers. All with minimal human casualty. Where's the lab, Monica? You can reverse engineer Terrigen, sure. But it'll be catastrophic and you know it. You were there on a day, and you know if we do it again, it's not going to just endanger in humans. It's going to endanger all of us. Last I checked, a day was your mess. Uh, damn it! Going to need a stronger table. I see some things haven't changed. Everything's just an experiment with you, isn't it? It is. Tarleton and humans. Me. Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! I'm going in. We need to find that lab. Jarvis, sensors detect aim forces incoming. Tarleton's come for his sidekick. Nat, Quinjet. You read my mind. Stay with me. All right. Hey, uh, just watch yourself out there. I will if you will. Kamala, let's go. We can't let AIM stop us from getting these inhumans in front of the press. They seem eager to secure Miss Rappuccini. Jarvis, keep an eye on our guest. She's a slippery one. Jarvis, door! <laughs> Jarvis, can you open this one? Sorry, sir. AIM is locking me out. Guess we do this the old-fashioned way. Well, this just escalated. Tell you what, you survived this. Maybe you can work for me. That would be fun. Great. Focus on the angry robots. I'll bring down the flying hunk of metal. With pleasure. Bruce, how are we doing on getting pissed off? More like it. Yeah. Aim him at the bad guys and get gone. Way ahead of you. Think again. Tony, we need air support. Get up here now. Be right there. Jarvis, drop the cannon. Carlton's gotta be heading your way soon. Make your way to the control. 
control room, kid. Punch anything that gets near those energy cores. You got it. Miss Khan, they just breached the control room. I'm on my way. Please do hurry. Jarvis isn't home anymore, Kamala. This ends now! Guys? I got a problem here. Guys! I've made sure your new friends won't know until it's too late. You still gotta go through me! You should have accepted my offer. So, Miss Khan, thank you. But I'm afraid Dr. Rappuccini has escaped. In trouble, Kamala! I need you on the deck now! I'm coming! Monica, she's escaping. We're here live at the AIM experience in Manhattan, witnessing the return of the Avengers, but they, they appear to be attacking the city! Keep rolling, keep rolling! Is it any coincidence that this attack comes on the very day that AIM is supposed to unveil their promising new adaptoid program? Oh, shit. Why? 
You did what you were supposed to do, Thor. You gave up your power. You should have stayed forgotten. Never with mortals of error. Where do you hide, Doctor? Did you not face me? Look around. I'm everywhere. He missed me as well. Aim dropships inbound. I see them. Focus on those mechs. Yeah. Kamala, you okay? Yep. Nope. Ours, but the engines are still dead. Last half full, Nat. Good night, folks. Wait a minute. That's the dead. We're the terrorists in this aim experience story. Not on my watch. The Chimera can't go down. Not again. Wanted <laughs> some drones heading for the command deck. Got my hands full, kid.
Nice, or you're both getting muted. I think you'll find this shield familiar, Stark. How original! You gonna steal my haircut next? Oh, wait! The damage has already been done, Avengers. No one will see you at all. Kamala, Tony? We're trying to restart the engines, but there's not enough power. We're out of time, people. Brace for impact! Hey! God of Thunder! Stay behind me! Now! Bring it! Completely lost your senses. Ah, prodigal son returns. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan. Well, holier than thou, where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Tarleton was up to. These adaptoids of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They expose them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. Yeah, and that is only step one. Georgie boy is gearing up for a war. And what's worse is Kamala here has found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? Aye. Show me this footage. Jarvis? Are you done? I've broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! We have to shut down the reactor! It's pulling us towards that heat signature. I've tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. Then get out. And seal the door. What? George! Go! No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck! What? Evacuate! No! No, 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 Cap. What are you doing? No, 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 no! <sighs> Just stop. What are you doing? No. Cap smashed the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? 
Hundreds of people were infected. People died. Nat, Just take it easy. Don't you take some responsibility, Tony. Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? It, what I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked her DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. <laughs> Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Maybe that's why Monica got the better of you. <laughs> this thing in the air? For quite some time, yes. Oh, that's a relief. Without proof, there's no hope. But I can't just give up. This can't be how it ends. I can't believe I'm all alone in here. Interrogation of Monica? Certainly, miss. You can access it in the interrogation antechamber. If I may be so bold, Miss Khan, what do you hope to find in the interrogation footage? I don't know. I have to try something. Maybe she slipped up. No offense, Jarvis, but I sure wish there was another person on board. None taken, Miss Khan. Interrogation footage. There's got to be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. <laughs> Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice. Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. N no, no, don't, Jarvis, I didn't mean to. Hello? Beta, is that you? Oh. Well, come on, uh, if you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry, I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared. A little unsure. 
the important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. will launch scour the earth you will not find our lab scour the earth you will not find our lab scour the earth you will not scour the earth scour the earth that's it of course the satellite the satellite Avengers, if you can hear me, I think I found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. People believe in the Avengers, not just because of your cool powers, but, but because no matter how bad things get, no matter how much you disagree, you always come together. Don't you get it? Your differences are your greatest superpower. I was just... Some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. shouldn't have said I get it altitude dry ice look I'm uh, not very good at I'm sorry so same good enough yeah. so you uh Found a clue? Yeah, it's the interview. Listen. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, and then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study inhumans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Okay, so we know where we need to go. We just need a way to get there. Project Star Booster. As I recall, you abandoned it because you couldn't generate enough acceleration in the auxiliary rockets. Yeah, yeah, no need to bore everyone with the details. 
That was before I had access to Mr. Shrinky. Jarvis, get Pim on the phone. We need a way to get up to this space lab. He's the only one who can help. Let's, uh... Please tell me this is a social call. Yeah, it is. Uh, I'd like to socialize with a few of your Pim particles. Need to shrink down an accelerator. <sighs> well, then you'll need to break into a high-security aim facility. Ever heard of Meridian? You're gonna have a hard time getting in. That place is no joke. Widow? I gotta say, you give a hell of a speech when you're pissed at us. <sighs> Look, Nat, we were idiots. I'm... As much as I love your squirming, it sounds like we've got work to do. I can get us to Meridian. Us? We're in this together, right? No time to lose. <laughs>